This racket is the Victor Thruster F and it's used by many professionals such as Hendra Setuan, Praveen Jordan, oh, and now us. Yeah, and in this video, we're gonna explain why we think this racket is the best racket in the world and also hopefully help you decide if it's the best racket for you. So let's get to it. So you've just seen the matte black, gold and rose gold design of this racket. We think it looks so cool. Anyway, this racket is the updated model of the original Thruster F. So let's outline the new specifications before we give you our detailed thoughts. So we have this racket in a 4U, weighing in at around 87 grams, but it does also come in a 3U version. Now you might have already noticed something a little unusual about this racket, and that's the shape of it. Just looking at this racket compared to my old Aura Speed 90K, you can see this slightly unusual head shape. It's very rectangular, with the racket face actually 4% bigger than most other rackets, which helps to create a larger sweet spot. And this bigger sweet spot is something we've really noticed. When we first saw this racket, we thought it would be quite difficult to play with, but this longer head shape isn't noticeable at all when playing. In fact, we got used to playing with this racket extremely quickly, scarily quickly in fact. We also tested this theory out with lots of club players and without prompting, many said that they felt this bigger sweet spot and that they were able to time their shots better and more consistently as a result. This is likely due to a combination of features, the head shape definitely being one, but also the racket not weighing too much or being overly stiff or head heavy, which we'll go on to discuss now. So generally, a top of the range racket like this will have a stiff shaft as it's aimed more towards intermediate and advanced players who have good enough technique and timing to create power from this stiff shaft while still hitting the sweet spot. And whilst this racket is stiffer than other rackets we've used in the past, like Greg's Aura Speed 90K, we feel it's really easy to use and quickly maneuver in your hand. This will also be helped by the new handle on the racket. It's not wood. Victor have developed this free core technology, which essentially means the shaft can be more flexible, which improves your control and it absorbs more shock, which makes it more comfortable to hit with. Again, the club players that we asked to test this racket agreed, except for one person who was used to a very stiff racket that we personally don't get along with. Some rackets are so stiff, it's like I'm using a baseball bat. So, as you can see, this racket is evenly balanced, which is shown by the manufacturer's racket specifications. For us, we found this balance point is perfect, Enough weight in the head for powerful overhead shots, which is probably why Praveen Jordan uses it, but still lightning fast both in defence and also at the net, which is probably why Setuan chose it. So when you get the racket, it comes unstrung with a set of VBS 68. This is the string I've used for the last four years or so, and I absolutely love it. We both string our rackets at 30 pounds, or around 13.5 kilos if you work in kilos. But Victor's guidelines actually state that this racket can be strung up to 31 pounds, or 14 kilos, for the 4U model, or 32 pounds, or 14.5 kilos, for the 3U model. This gives you great peace of mind if you do want to string at these higher tensions, as a lot of manufacturers' maximum tensions usually only go up to around 28 pounds. So we've been using this racket for around two months now. It's a great all-round racket and possibly, in our opinion, the best racket in the world. We can definitely see it being really popular with both intermediate and advanced players who want a racket that provides them with a bit of everything, control, speed, and power. Unlike on a game such as Mario Kart, where some cars have a five out of five rating on speed, but then only have a two out of five rating on control or handling, we're going to say this racket has a five out of five rating on everything. What a victory. But yeah, this rating is probably shown by us both choosing this racket after trying out over seven others. It's also actually the first time that we both had the same racket. We love it and there's a good chance you will too. If you do want to know more about how to choose the right badminton racket for you, then we actually have a blog post on our website going into detail on this. We'll include a link in the description below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, smash the subscribe button if you haven't already, and we'll see you on another video.